Hello everyone, and today we're going to be reviewing um, Slim V Toms and A. Sorry if I have less energy today. I just came home from college because I couldn't record yesterday or post because I came home late from college. So today, um, if I seem tired and less energy, I'm sorry about that. But let's get into it. I got the video right here again. I can't review it on the screen because I will get copyright striked. Let's review it. Alright. Good thing is that Slim's already ready. He's already bouncing on his feet. He's already like bouncing on his feet. He's like, okay, come on. I'm ready, bro. I'm ready. And then Tom Zanetti is dead focused. He's literally looking at his opponent. Dead focused. So he's like, he's ready. And again, quote my marks. I literally said quote my marks in one of my videos. Tom Zanetti is Slim's toughest test and it was his toughest test. Slim was struggling to knock him out. This is the second time he did not knock out anyone. He still won by decision, but he didn't knock, knock him out. I knew Tom Zanetti was going to be difficult, more difficult than Ryan Taylor. Right, one good thing is that Slim is like, he's ranging. He's using his range again. Again, another thing Slim said is that this isn't his weight class. Like, he's flying at a higher weight class. He's usually a lower weight class. So, props to him. He's doing very good. And Tom's very good. Obviously, he's doing this, which is a shit stance. But, he's doing good for himself. He's blocking very good as well. Both of them bouncing. Yeah. Goes for a jab. Doesn't get hit there. Again, clinching. They clinch. There's not that much that goes in this fight so far. Body shot, good from Slim. Because he had a stance right here. So Slim went for a body shot. Which is a good, 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 good thing. He did that good. Oh, Slim went for a jab. Obviously, he, he dropped his hands down. Tom's and Eight dropped his hands down because I think maybe he thought he was gonna go for the body. When said Slim went for upwards and then Tom's and Eight just slipped it. Mad. I think he hit Slim there while they were in the clinch. He broke the clinch and punched him with a right. Yeah, Slim needs to be very patient. Again, he's using his energy and he's overthrowing now, which isn't good from Slim. He should stop overthrowing. Like right here, he's throwing hair bows. One thing, it will waste your energy. And number two, it's easier to get hit. Okay, good from Slim. He's keeping that range. He's keeping that range. Oh, got caught with two rights there. They were in a jumble, a little bit of a jumble there because Slim was just ducking down. Again, a mistake that he does. I've seen like people recommend to duck like this with your head upwards. He's ducking like that. Slim is still doing a rookie mistake and he's ducking like that. He's ducking like that. So he can't even see Tom properly. Oh, that was good from Slim. Calm a little bit on the right with the glove. Because again, his stance was like this. So Slim hit him on the side like that. So that was good. He's already getting a little bit tired as well. Slim's already getting a little bit tired. <coughs> I 
Again, that's another bad thing from Tom Zanetti. He's throwing hair barrels. He's throwing hay barrels. Both of them are throwing hair barrels, which isn't good. It's going to waste a lot of energy. Because I think Zanetti's trying to go for the knockout. Oh, bang, bang. Come twice right there, Slim. I need to analyze this very carefully just so you guys know. One good thing is that as soon as Slim, as soon as he went for the hair bow, Slim moved back and then Tom's and A went like this. So he kept his hand there so he could hit the other shot. So then Zanetti, I think, went for a body shot. No, over hook. Slim stepped backwards just like, uh, just like uh, Salt Papi does. He went like that. So he stepped backwards. And then after that, Dr. Thunder, bang, bang. So, Tom Zanetti he doesn't, he doesn't know about changing levels yet. So, he just started, right? So, he doesn't know about changing levels. So, Slim, what he did smartly is he did changing levels. So, he ducked under so that he could get inside Zanetti when I bang, bang on the top like that. Two shots right there. Right there. Clean. One. Two right there, clean. And Tom's, uh, they're having difficulty here. Eh? He's trying to defend himself. Tom's in a E. He's trying to, uh, trying to defend himself. Now they're both in a clinch. Sims, like, come on, let's go. One thing about Tom is that he's very reckless. By the way, Prime, we got the Prime right here. Not sponsored, but we got the Prime. No, but the thing is though is that both of them are throwing hay barrels for no reason one thing slim said in a video is he said that oh yeah i'm doing this just so that i, I was too cocky i had a big ego like I, that guy was just talking shit to me in the ring and i had a huge ego so i had to put him in his place but instead he just wasted all of his energy which he should have just saved his energy and then if you played the later rounds, maybe he could have gone the knockout. Because Zanetti also did the same thing. He wasted all, his, all of his energy. And if Slim saved his energy, he would have been able to knock him out, I think, that easy. That was a good jab. That's why I don't recommend the stance. Because Slim just went with the... Over, he was putting his hand out, and then he followed up with a jab. So basically what happened is, is uh, because um, obviously it's like to find his range. So he found his range and then when you do like this, it's easy to get hit in the face. So bang, it came uh, uh, right on the face, straight to the face. That was a good body shot. Obviously, because Slim was trying to step backwards, he hit him on the body. Again, another hay barrel from Zanetti. Again, it's no use. You're going to waste your energy. And that's what happened in this fight. In the first round, second round, he was already done. Oh, well, that was good. They dodged a hay barrel against Slim. Slim changing levels a lot, which is very good. He's trying to trick Zanei. He's trying to trick him. He's trying to test him a little bit. He's changing levels, which is good. Because Slim's in, been in the scene for a very long time. In the boxing scene. Jab. Again, that's why I don't recommend the stance. Slim followed up just like Pineda. Followed up, bang, bang. Followed up with a jab. Come up with a right. So basically, he was like this. So he got through the guard and hit him right there two straight jabs to the face and then open the guard and he's hit him four, three times he's hit him three times what the hell so one thing slim does well as he did with Ryan Taylor, is he broke the guard. So he broke Tom's and 80's guard, bang, and went boom. 
Oh! Basically what happened is when he leaded with a jab, he broke his guard and then he punched a bang bang right there. That's why I don't recommend that stance. Never in your life ever do this stance. Never in your life do this boxing stance. Never. It's, it doesn't work. If your coach says this, don't follow it. Tell him I want to do another defense stance because it's not effective. It's not effective. It's a very bad defensive strategy. Oh, that was a good shot from Slim. Come on, came up with the right. That was a good shot. Again in the clinch. They're in the clinch. Yeah, and the round's done. The round's done. Oh damn, the third creed's coming out. I'm gonna watch that defo. Slim was a beast this round. He did pretty good. I have, anyway, I definitely have Slim for first round. Definitely I have Slim for first round. This round apparently is where Slim said I, w I wanted to knock him out. Apparently this is the round where Slim wanted to knock him out. So there are going to be a lot of punches in this round. Oh! Already, oh! Already broke the guard. He already broke the guard again and came up with a right already. Already. Again, Tom Zane threw a hairbell. He's gonna get his energy is gonna get decreased now. Don't know how we're still surviving. Another hair battle from Tom Zane and he missed. Okay, I didn't see any punches there, didn't see any there, they're still, they're clinching, they're clinching. Didn't see any punches there, maybe one or two from both of them, I don't know. Good thing Slim does is he circles around. Again, another hair bow from Tom's and eight. Again, another one. He's gonna get. Uh, he's gonna get. His energy level is gonna go down. And in the third round, that's what happened. And he's just. He's just. Another jab, which is good. The timing of Slim is crazy. Slim has perfect timing. He has perfect timing because Tom Zane went like this. He backed up and then he punched him again. So he has a very he has very good timing, which is good from Slim. Good for his fights. And Tom Zane already looks tired. His face is red. Clench again. Good, he steps out. Tom Zane tries to go to the body, misses. And Slim comes up back with a right hand. So basically, Tom's, uh, Tom Zane went to the body. Because you go to the body, your whole this whole place is open. So he should have at least covered up here. So he went back up. And Slim went bang, bang. He came up with a jab and a hook. Another hook. A jab and a hook right there. Because Tom Zane was open. Then defend himself properly. This is gonna be a long ass video. Another clinch. Another trade from Slim after getting in that clinch. 
Again, Slim breaking the guard comes up with a right. And then Tom's and A hits him with some shots here because he was breaking the guard. Again, another right from Slim. Another hook. Oh, another double jab. Again, Tom Zane is falling, falling for the changing levels. So again, Slim ducked under and went up, bang, bang, and he changed levels again. Again, a right hand trying to break the guard. Again, hit him on the right, broke the guard again, Slim. Another right. And Tom is just reckless now. He's just getting reckless. He's getting very reckless now. Another right. Okay, that was good from Tom. He went for two body shots and he went for a, a little hook because Slim was trying to clinch. But instead he hit him with two body shots and he was going to come up with a hook, but he missed. Bang. Breaks the guard again. There we go. And Slim's breaking the guard. That's why I like Slim. He, he's, Tom Zane is like this. He's holding it tight. But he knows how to break the guard. He knows how to break the guard. He did that with Ryan Taylor. But he could have done it much more effectively with Ryan Taylor. Tom looks dead tired. He doesn't want to fight anymore, it looks like. Another body. Boom. Another coming at the top. Oh! After the clinch, Tom came up with a right. Another right from Slim, I'm thinking. Yeah. Another right from Slim because he broke the guard and Tom dropped his hands down. And again, Tom's timing's not good. He's just swinging. He should actually take a little break, escape from Slim, and then attack him again. He shouldn't be trading like this. An uppercut from Slim. Misses the hook. It's only 12 seconds left. Boom! Right there. Boom! Boom! Slim is insane. Let me watch that real close. He goes for an uppercut because, again, Tom Zane trying to do a hay barrel. Again, he got uppercutted. And as soon as he got uppercutted, his hand's all the way down here. So when it's down here, Slim comes up. Again, his arms are uh, because he's tied. His hands are down, right? And then he's open still and bang, bang. His hands are down, trying to grab Slim's hand. He drops him down and goes bang, bang. That's what happens when you're tired. Comes up with a right Slim does. Oh my days. How is the right not finished? My God. Slim is insane, man. He's a beast, bro. Sorry, right now, honestly, honestly, right now, I don't think he has the potential to beat KSI, but he could if he like properly tries and trains. I have Slim again for the second round. I have him for the second round. Tom's today came up with two rights there. Bang. Bang. Slim is insane. Slim again dropping his hands down. Getting that stance, okay. He's trying to change levels, trying to fake him. He has the correct stance.
but he puts his arm out he puts it like this to block him off and then Tom just comes up with a vicious vicious right vicious right and in this fight if you look at my video mark my words if you look at my Tom Zanetti video my analysis I said that he is going to he has a lot of power I even said that he has a lot of power so this shows you how much power he has and bang comes up with a right Slam again he's like okay I need to chill now I need to chill tags him Again, now Tom's dodging more. Tom's not being careless now. He's fine, very good. He's not being careless. Again, he went for the hair bow. Hey, hey, the <coughs> hey bow, the the overhand which was very unnecessary again well one thing that Tom Zane is doing good is he's leaning like that to make it very confusing for for slim again slim goes for a hay barrel but he misses they shouldn't be going for big overhands Again, Slim goes for an overhand. It's gonna waste your energy. What's the use of doing an overhand? Do in the last round. It'll waste your energy, you'll get tired, and most likely, you'll get hit with more punches. That's what happens. Again, they're just trying to trade, but oh, okay. Tom's and he comes with a with a with a right hand to the body because Slim was backing up, dropped his hands down. He was trying to relax, and Tom just came in, boom, boom. One on the face, one on the face right there, which was good from Tom. The thing is with Slim is he should have stayed longer because he's a taller guy and he has longer arms. Oh, that was good. Changing levels again. Like I said, he changed levels again and he came up with a right, which is very good from Slim. Oh, he was open and the Slim came again. With a right, I let me let me analyze that very slowly. Tom was like this. As I'm seeing in the footage, he's dropped his hand down, so this whole part of his face is open, and then he's then he's just open. He's like completely open. He's literally trying to jab out. Then again, he doesn't. He doesn't keep his he doesn't go back to his stance quickly. He just keeps his hand down, which is not good He should go back to his stance straight away And because of this Because he doesn't go back to his stance properly slim changes levels and comes up with a butt with a right Not now with a right right there. Because Tom is too open. He's too curly. He's like, duh, 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 duh. Then he's dropping his hands. Then sometimes he's doing like this. Then he's dropping his hands down again. Then he's going like that. Then he's going like that. He's stretching out too much. He's too open. And because of that, Slim's caught catching him. Slim got caught a little bit. Well caught right here, but instead again Tom was open again. He was jabbing out Again, he was doing the same mistake and slim calm with a right hand like bang right there again
jab, like a soft jab, because this stance is shit. So he jabbed him and he went back. Soft jab. <coughs> one good technique, uh, one thing good technique Tom Zane did is he pushed it down. So in case someone went for a jab, he could have blocked it, which is good. Hit him on the body. Bang. Again, Slim is just... Slim is just catching him. He's too open. I think Tom is just tired. He's too open. He can't He can't do it. He's wasted all his energy, energy in the first round. Slim says on his video that I would give the third round to Tom Zanetti. I would give the third round to Slim. Unless Tom makes a major comeback right now. Oh, we got caught a little bit with the right hand. Bang! Oh, again! Oh, never mind, he came back. Tom came back, Tom tonight came back. Oh my days. Oh my Daisy came back. Now Slim's taking it slow. He's like, shit, I need to take this very carefully. I need to slow it down. I need to slow the pace down. Just pop my jab. Pop my jab. And again, Slim's doing a very good job of breaking the breaking the guard. Yeah, honestly, I would say Tom, it was a draw. I would say that round is a draw. Slim and Tom, they both drawed. I don't think it was, I don't think it was, um, I don't think it was, I don't think Tom or Slim won. I think they both drawed. They drew together. <laughs> Eubank, Junior, V. Smith. Yeah, I would say that it's a tie. I would say that round is a draw. Some getting out of the way, which is good. That doesn't count because he hit him on the shoulder. He hit him on the shoulder right here, which it doesn't count as a... Okay. Caught him with their slim because he was again with the same guard. Again, Tom has dropped his hands on a little bit, but he's kept him at a very good level. No clinching. Got the clinch again. Again, Slim trying to do the same technique. Duck under, come up with the hook. Duck under, come up with the hook, which is working so far with Tom. It's working so far with Tom. Don't know why the ref is blocking. The ref's literally blocking it, bro. Oh, that was good. Slim again doing the technique. Duck under. Go for right. It's a good technique for um, changing levels. Like he's changing levels and trying to trick Tom. Bang, bang, breaking that guard. And Tom's like, "Come on, let's go. I'm here. I'm here." Another right from Slim. Again, he's using the same technique. He's changing levels. He's breaking that guard. He's not gone to the body though. Not a single time this guy has gone to the body. He only goes for the head. 
He never goes to the body. He could go to the body and he could end it quick. That's why Pineda is very good and he beat B-Day because he went to the body and he came up on the top. Slim should be doing that. Nothing's happened so far. Jabbing. Some keeping that range. It's good. He's jabbing. He's jabbing. Yeah. Keep the range. I kept on saying. I said to. I said before in this video. He needs to keep that range. Keep that range. Oh, came up with the right. On the ear. Hit the ear right here. Right here. Breaking the guard again. Which is very good. Oh, that was good. Oh, that was good from Tom. He went like this. Sim, he knew he was going to punch him on both sides. Tom, Doctor, and went bang, bang, bang. Or, like, came up. You know, which is...